protecting your pages with authorization schemes. Now that you've let your user into the application with your authentication scheme, let's explore ways to limit the user's access around the application. There are many options within Apex to hide certain components and security is built in. So first we need to define our authorization scheme. Think of it like a role. So there's authorization schemes. We currently don't have any defined, so let's create a new one from scratch. And we'll call it admin. And we have a number of options for our scheme type. In this case, for simplicity, we'll use the function returning a Boolean. And we'll just return true if the current user is equal to admin. And our error message would be you are not you're not an administrator if that scheme is violated. So we'll create that scheme. And now we need to apply these to a few components. So let's do one for the video page. If you edit the page properties, down the bottom, there is a security section. There's our authorization scheme, which we can say is or must be admin. So we'll apply that. And in our products report, we'll hide one of the columns. So let's hide the weight class. We can also use the tabs across the top to quickly link down to where the authorization is. And also on this page, we'll protect the create button so they can't create a new product. Now when we run this application, I'm currently logged in as admin. So I can see the wait class and the create button. So let's log out and log in as a Wesley user. Now when I go into the products screen, I can't see the wait class. I can no longer see the create button. And if I try and link to the videos page, I get that error message that we defined because my access was denied. So it shows that we also need to secure the links to our secured pages just for neatness. So what we've done is essentially defined a role within Apex and attributed that role to certain components, which stops them from rendering during the generation of a page. Next up, we'll look at securing session state and demonstrate a form of row-level security.